proverb says that there are friends who destroy each other, but a real friend sticks closer than a brother. So today we're talking about true friendship. Hey, I couldn't help but overhear from where I was eavesdropping, and I am so excited for this cruise. Roman, what are you talking about? Ready to set sail on the true friends ship. You know, the cruise that's only for the truest of friends. Yeah, that's not a thing. Then where did I get these brochures? You see that? It's a Chinese takeout menu. Oh yeah, that explains why I'm so hungry. You want sweet and sour or uh, General Tso's? General Tso's, please. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, I'm Cameron. And I am your humble servant, Roman. Okay, uh, and today we're talking about true friendship and how true friends stick closer than a brother. Wait a minute, we're brothers. Yeah. We're pretty close. I'd say so. But so you're telling me to be true friends, we gotta be even closer? Well, I don't know about that. Bring it in! Ah. Oh. Is this close oh. enough? Oh. So much breath. Hey, I'm Cameron. And I'm Roman. And today we're talking about true friendship. Uh, I had a true friend once. Oh, here we go. We were the best of friends you ever did see. I was but a humble little cowboy and he was a simple astronaut. At first, I was jealous of him because he was getting all the attention until one day he rescued me from the clutches of the weird next door neighbor. Buzz and I even flew behind a moving truck. Okay. Oh, and there was also a bunch of aliens in a claw machine. Yeah, yeah, I figured that was where that was going. Yeah, I think you're just talking about Toy Story. You got a friend in me. You got Today, we're talking about how a true friend sticks closer than a brother. Ah, what a nice sentiment. I've heard that before. What's that from? The Bible? No, no, that's not it. Yeah, I, I'm pretty you sure You know that's... what it was? It was that one time that I had to cross a troll bridge and I had to answer his riddles three. Hi, I'm Cameron. And I'm Roman. And today we're talking about true friends. Roman, tell them what a true friend does. Totally, I got this. They give you the best foot rubs. Oh, no. And they let you borrow their truck when you need to move something really heavy. I mean, maybe, but not what I was going for. They don't make a fuss when you double dip a chip. I just really don't like it when you take a bite and then dip again. Some friend. Roman, I'm sorry. You know what's crazy? What? We finished each other's sandwiches. sandwiches. That's, That's what, what I was gonna, gonna say. say. Hey, I'm Cameron, and today we're talking about being a true friend. You know, Proverbs says that there are friends who destroy each other, but a real friend sticks closer than a brother. Roman, yet yeah, what? Do you want to be friends? Sure, yeah. Hooray! <laughs> Today, we're talking about how true friends stick closer than a brother. Yeah, stick together, you say? Mm-hmm. I got this. Oh, no. Ah! What? Why is... You know, this seems unnecessary. Hey, Roman. Yes, Cameron? You know who the best kind of friend is? Who's that? The kind that sticks with you through thick and thin. You know, they're always by your side. Mmm, yes. Sticky friends. My favorite. Just two pals covered in honey. What? Shall we? No, I, I don't want that. More for me. Proverbs 18.24 says there are friends who destroy each other, but a real friend sticks closer than a brother. Ooh, sounds intense. Say, which kind of friends do you think we would be? Probably the sticky kind. Totally. Yeah. Today we are talking about true friends. Proverbs 18.24 says there are friends who destroy each other, but a real friend sticks closer than a brother. The kind of friendship that God has in mind for you, the kind of friend he wants you to be, is not a wishy-washy one. Ooh, fun word alert. God wants us to be the kind of friend who sticks around in the bad times and the good times. When it's easy and when it's hard. We should be the kind of friend Jesus was, one who truly cares for their friends. We were made to become like Jesus. And we become more like Jesus when we treat each other well.